Hi everyone. I want to take the time now to show you how I make my vegan sesame seed milk, which serves as like a soy milk, almond milk substitute, and you can do it at home yourself, which I really love making my own stuff. So, here we go. To start with, you're going to need the white hulled sesame seeds. And I get a, a bulk thing of them, store them in a glass jar. And then I'm going to take about a half cup here. This little cup, about a half cup. Easy enough. And I like glass jars, so I use glass jars a bit. And now I'm going to pour these in the glass jar. Boom. And we're going to go over here. Add a little bit of filtered water to it. And we're gonna soak those babies overnight. So we got a little water in there. Here we go. And then they're just sitting in there, nice. Just gonna stir them up a little bit. And then they're just gonna soak there overnight. And then uh, we're gonna make it into milk. All right, here we are back the next morning and our sesame seeds, they have been sitting overnight in the water. Let's open them up, take a look. We got some little bubble action going on in there. Can you see the bubble action? Yeah, means they're alive. They're sprouting. It's alive. So, don't you put me in there, that's not cool. Uh, some cardamom, which I just ground fresh this morning, a few minutes ago actually. I like freshly ground, has the nice flavor, and if you really want to do it up, you can toast the cardamom seeds, which brings out even more flavor, but who's got time for that all the time? Not me. And then, I like to add a little bit of clove, just a touch. And that was one cardamom pod there, by the way, too. And I ground up some fresh nutmeg. Put that in there. And a little bit of vanilla extract. Just a touch. Mm. Organic vanilla. Yum. And then give that a little stir. All these guys a little stirred up here. Now we're going over. to the blender, our happy little blender here. And now, I wanna get about eight ounces. So I'm gonna just, I don't see the ounces fit on there, but. Oh yeah, there it is. Half a cup. Yep, so oh, we got cup. one cup right here. We can see the measure right there. We need just a little bit more. But, um, it seems to work well for me for this. Actually, I'm just gonna rest it there because that's fine. It's a little lower. It's gonna be a little, but this is fine. I I think um, this is all up to play. Um, I put about half a cup of sesame seeds. You can do more. You can do less. Depends how thick and how much you like it. And this is kind of the part where you get to play with. Um, so blend them up. Eleven. Well, it's going to ten. Eleven, Andy. There we go. Boom. And. There we go. We have delicious sesame milk. Now this sesame milk, it's not sweet. So I did, I did. It's not sweet. So you're gonna wanna add some maple syrup, sugar, honey, whatever you want to it. Then add it to your favorite morning cereal, or for me, my morning 
uh, I call it porridge, all kinds of yummy stuff. But there you go. You got sesame milk, and um, it's fresh. Um, you can um, put it in the fridge if you make a lot, and uh, it'll store for like a day or two, I've heard. But it is live. It's got lots of good enzymes in there, and they're not going to last for a very long time. So I would I just make mine as I need it. But you can make a, a few batches ahead and keep it in the fridge. So um, I hope you enjoy. And uh, yeah, have a good one.